New at 10, tonight, one of LA's fanciest restaurants, perched high in downtown LA, has added what they call a security fee. Gillette Diner says, ridiculous. Experts say this may just be the beginning. Fox 11's Chelsea Edwards live for us tonight at Perch in downtown LA to explain what's going on here. Chelsea. Alex, we all know the cost of doing business is rising, and restaurants, especially here in downtown L.A., say they need more security now than ever. And you can see the visible security presence here outside the entrance to Perch, but this new fee is certainly sparking a lot of controversy. I think that's a good idea. I don't, I don't want to pay that. <laughs> Brian Alfaro was talking about a new 4.5% security fee now being added to diners' bills at Perch in downtown L.A. Uh, I think it's a bad idea because, I mean, we're already paying a lot for those restaurants. He and his girlfriend are celebrating her birthday on the famed rooftop restaurant. That's a lot, personally, but... I mean, it is what it is. This receipt highlighting the new fee recently sparked a viral debate on Reddit, and experts say it's likely just the beginning. What we're seeing is that there are additional fees being placed at many sit-down restaurants, such as cleaning fees, COVID fees, credit card swipe fees, also ranging from th um, 3 to 5 percent. And I think this is going to continue. They're facing major costs, and the only way to kind of deal with this other than raising menu prices, which could turn off people from coming to the restaurant, is to add these surcharge fees at the checkout. On its website, Perch says the fee helps protect its team members and guests and that the money goes directly to security costs. How hard is it for, for restaurant owners to be surviving in this climate right now? Any restaurant owner that survives in this climate, I think, is a champion just for being open. Chef and restaurant owner Andrew Gruel says he's not surprised by the new fee, but doesn't personally believe that added line items help restaurants in the long run. And I think it hurts the worker. And the reason it hurts the worker is, is that when somebody's dining out and they see a fee, then they typically take it out on what they otherwise would have tipped the, uh, the team member in the restaurant. Frankly, at the end of the day, you know, just put a jar out and be like, hey, you want to leave a couple dollars so that we can hire private security because this is going to leave a bad taste in the customer's mouths. Many diners say they're fine with the new charge. It just makes you feel safer, you know, with it. I mean, I'm not paying. My boyfriend is. But if I were paying, yeah. This website, Perch, does make it clear that that additional fee should not be considered a tip. We have reached out to Perch for comment, but haven't yet heard back. Reporting live from downtown L.A., I'm Chelsea Edwards. Alex, Christine, I'll send it back to you. Good for her. She didn't have to pay. All right, Chelsea Edwards, thank you. We're alerting.